Hey, yeah, mister. Thanks for the follow. Position is obscured. Okay. Do I have Skulljack? I do. Let's look for an advent officer. We can steal the soul of or whatever it is we're doing. Where'd all my frames go? You guys steal my frames while I was uh in the bathroom? Pretty rude. Your mech to my right. There's something out there. I say your mech's just up there, probably. Scop TV 555. Thanks so much for the follow up to the stream. Can I make that move? I'm on the move. I'll try to believe it. Okay. So, our sharpshooter doesn't have the best lines of sight, but we'll probably be able to get one shot off against something every turn. Ouchma! Thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Maybe we should move up to this rooftop with her. She doesn't have the most hit points, but it's not like anybody else has a lot of hit points either. Jumper, you just listed like seven different words. That was amazing. On the move. Oh, oh, it was a big robot. Oh, I see. Big robot and some friends. On the move. I've been a hostile patrol. Lots of friends. The advent captain nearby would make an ideal target for the skulljack. The skulljack? The skulljack? Autos confirmed on the move. No. No way! Okay. That's awesome. All right. Way. Cool. Yay. Position confirmed. Apparently, from here we have good enough vision off the rooftop to shoot everything. So let's just. just uh, I'm gonna move up. Let's move All up to way. here. It's steady. I guess you can see quite a lot of stuff off this rooftop. I'm looking for them just to walk into me, and then we start fighting. Goodbye, friends. You have to use it at close range. And also for you. All of the memes are here today. So glad you guys could join us. Am I about to take uh, an Overwatch ambush against an Andromedon, which can only be half killed, and two snakes who are immune to Overwatch? I think I am. No, those are the sniper snakes, right? I think they're the sniper snakes. I found 
found something. That doesn't sound good for the Andromedon. Does that mean it's dead? Oh, it's dead. That's unfortunate. Wait, the snake's dead too. Well, I don't know. That seemed perfectly balanced to me. Hey, it's getting to move for free. Oh, no, it's not. Murder most foul. Murder. <laughs> nice pot, nice pot. Late game enemies like Andromedons, man, they're just really, they're really tough to deal with. I don't know. I've been meaning to work out some way to kill those. I found a variety of memes from the loot drop. Or uh, loots, rather. Loots from the loot. Yeah. No, that's what you find in loot drops. Silly me. Let's drop a dense smoke on the team. Some overwatches against that advent pod. We would no doubt have heard us. But we don't know whether they're going to run at us or not right now. Yeah, Zell Knight. Overwatches are sort of nice sometimes. We didn't really even need Overwatch perks to do that, I don't think. We were just at close range to enemies while in concealment, and that's just going to kill them most of the time. I think my dense smoke is running out before we actually start fighting here. That's too bad. I'm gonna get evac coming just in case we get unlucky with yellow alert actions. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. Pretty sure I didn't think to bring a, a medkit. Apparently it's close. I'm gonna bring my assault back so that I don't trigger the pod with her while nobody else can overwatch against it. Oh, that is the cutest thing that I've ever seen. Okay. Um, hold on. Um. Um, I'm over here. What? We need to, we need to take a little break from XCOM. I apologize for this, uh, breaking your routinely scheduled programming. So if I go filters, chroma key turns off, you guys can see green again, pardon our mess. This is just like so cute. Just... You see her? Uh, on the exercise bike? She's like sprawled. She's on the seat of the exercise bike and she is just sprawled out. She is the happiest cat in the world right now. All right. Um, I felt like that was important. I wanted, I wanted to share it with you. Looks so happy. Anyway, back to overwatching. There are important things to do. Do you hear something? Why is there a clothes drying rack in the middle of the room? What? There isn't. 
there's a table with some stuff on it. It's uh, where Caitlin does her craft stuff. The drawer has a face. I think I heard something. I didn't know what that means. <laughs> but okay. Uh, they took a very circuitous path to us, but they have arrived. I guess we're not skulljacking the officer. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we won't be skulljacking the officer. That's too bad. All right, so we have up to five enemies here. Oh, shit. Oh, they actually, like, executed a uh, wait for help job. That was incredible. Not good. I mean, there's no reason that it wouldn't work, but that worked so well. That was really cool. So there's one yellow alert job where they'll, like, hover just outside of your vision and then move in against you once another pod is ready to do it with them. Basically to punish you for doing exactly what I was just doing. And they sure did. We're currently being punished super hard. As you can see. I'm not sure I'll come out of this alive, in fact. Maybe we can get lucky. Maybe we can get lucky. I don't know. I need to hit with all three of these. Can I actually not hit all of the tiles? Oh. I mean, hitting with two of them is probably fine as well. One time, Shredstorm Cannon. Roll high to hit, would ya? Oh wait, you hit 100% of the time. Oh wait. Let's... Step forward? Huh. Alright, kill you guys. I mean, if we're lucky. Let's go. I'm actually allowed to haywire protocol that while it's suppressing me. That's sort of funny. My graphics processing unit is the uh, main casualty of this mission. We have created a lot of debris on the map, and my graphics card is not quite sure how it feels about that. Hmm, that did not die. Garrick, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the stream. She runs hot. She's running fast.
not 100% sure what that shield bear is going to do. I'm going to try to keep it alive long enough to skull mine it, though. The Lancer will actually run at us and do something. So I was going to incendiary grenade plus flashbang it so that it can't anymore. Flashbang turns off its like run and stab and incendiary shoots off its shooting. Alright. Not really a huge fan of the fact that we let that shot happen. Overall, it seems to have been an okay mission, though. Gonna go out on a limb here and say that we've won at this point. Let's go. Okay, we gotta go forward so we can skull mine next turn. Explode this stuff. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> okay. I like it. Good. Assault has to run up and grab the loot. You gotta kill the mech with other people. What has happened to all of my friends? I would be yelling if I were a civilian right now. I think that's fair. Like at some point, XCOM actually is more terrifying than the aliens and the narrative narrative issues that come up with like the civilians being scared of you, but not sectoids, sort of go away. Lance Saro, thanks for the follow of the stream. It's like, yeah, okay. The guys who just blew up an entire city block with things mounted on their wrists are actually fairly frightening, especially since they killed half of your family while doing it. Trojan virus. So probably the largest difficulty in the campaign is going to be having an advent officer survive the overwatch turn so that I can skull jack him. Other than that, I feel like we're in pretty good shape. Very nice. I'll take 10 intel. Who's keeping score? This looks interesting. Hey, he dropped a regular stock. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for helping out, Advent Shield Bear. Yeah, we certainly exploded those guys pretty hard. I think we could start 0%ing missions probably if we wanted to. I'm not quite confident enough in that claim to do it. If you 0% guerrilla operations in like a two strength region, you'll end up fighting 30 enemies and they all get to shoot at you when they patrol into you, so that's the scariest part. Now soldiers are good enough to kill 30 enemies and do so quite rapidly. 
does not give me a facility lead. Facility leads are from missions where you like hack a workstation. I'm having some trouble finding them this campaign just because my regions aren't very well set up to spawn them. Suicide Vest was one of the first mods that I ever activated for XCOM 2. I have still yet to ever actually use one, though. I have since uninstalled it, in fact. It turns out that it's not actually a very, like, strong play to blow up one of your own soldiers. <laughs> Who could have guessed? I don't know. Okay, so that happened. We're at 64% on the black site. 10% on that supply raid. Which is heavy. Expected activity ludicrous. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'd never seen that before. That's that's great. We have 10 hours. Wait, this is light moderate? Huh. Probably didn't need eight soldiers then. Good night, Robo Jumper. No, I'm not going to 0% of supply rate here. It's just not necessary. Just not necessary. I have a grenadier officer who could lead the team. We could bring Michael Longhall McLean. Wait, where's our ranger? Yeah. She has twice as many AWC perks as she has regular perks. Her AWC perks are all really good, too. Volatile mix is maybe the worst one there, but it's still fine because we have rapid deployment. She needs a coil rifle. Should we build another coil rifle? I'll allow it. Needs a mag shorty. This is all late game equipment now, so I can build it without feeling too bad about myself. And there's nothing else that we really need the resources for. She already has resilience. Let's just go bullets. No SIM cards on my soldier. No SIM cards on her gun either. But advanced scope. She is likely to want to shoot stuff in our turn on this mission. Is that our last exosuit? How exciting! Hold our 14th Shredstorm cannon! <laughs> oh my god. I've officially snowballed this campaign. We'll see. We'll see. We're picking up 
an intermittent distress signal, and as far as we can tell, the aliens are hitting back against one of the resistance 